this show, we will meet a boy, Jaden, with a peculiar condition that his family can't even begin to talk about. Can you imagine having a baby who doesn't have genitalia? Well, we'll be discussing um, fatty liver with Dr. Amwakudia and a myth that is of great concern to men and some women. This show is brought to you by Vodafone. Further together. can be part of the extraordinary world of endless possibilities on Vodafone. With the best value and amazing data offers and services available in Ghana, your dreams are achievable. Get more for less with Vodafone Data. Vodafone. Further together. My partners in crime are with me right now looking all dashing. I really like the combination. <laughs> now, thank you, dear gentle. Do I am? Oh, Swedish. I like the color. Thank you very much. I like this much. color. I do. Thank you very I really much. Do. Thank you. Thank you very much. And Abba happens to be wearing my favorite lipstick color. Oh, we, what color is it on my lips again? I think it's burgundy or something like that. All right. Anyway, <laughs> enough of fashion. Let's see what we have for our mid today. <laughs> Poor daddy. He looked traumatized. He did. <laughs> he did. No wonder the midwives tell me that, well, they don't mind that daddy's helping the mother's labor. When it's time to push and see what really comes out, they would rather not. Because some of them do collapse. Because when they see their baby coming out, they think, I have to say, I say, I say, That is not why they are collapsing. You know, they are collapsing because when they see the amount of pain their wives are I doubt it. I doubt and it. And what's I'm telling you what I, you okay, know, tell us. you know, the amount of pain that the <laughs> wife is going through. They are thinking, I did not say You see, you see. <laughs> we are I thinking think, the same I thing. I think that, I think that men and women's mind work different. I'm telling you what, what, what you will think when you see your wife going through all of that. Mm -hmm. You know, to see that 10 centimeter cranium coming out, mm. crowning, mm. everything stretches, rounded. Exactly, stretches. You know, it stretches round it and you can see. I mean, it's not easy to just see your wife there and be saying, oh, wow, a baby is coming. You get, it's a, lot, it's a lot to take in. I mean, kudos to all the men who have been bold enough to go into like, the labor room and assist with their wife providing emotional support and... Oh, man, yeah. when push has come to real <laughs> show, literally. Yeah, yeah, you are standing there giving moral support. Hey, 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 Please do tell them whether it's true or not, because we know the truth. Um, so the truth is, I mean, that one is a corner where only you and your husband may be seeing. Mm. But look at the woman in general. Mm. Pre-pregnancy, post-pregnancy, she returns to almost splendid before pregnancy. I mean, if she's eating well and everything. So, yes, it doesn't permanently expand. There will be some changes, mm. like... The whole body going through some changes, you know. My wife's having to do some pot belly. I'm 
developing now. It's changes. It's life changes. Yeah, yeah prosperous. <laughs> <laughs> so you see my point is usually we focus so much on the woman's changes yes. but I mean I believe I'm changing as well from when she saw me I was, I was a very sporting guy six playing pack tennis and all that. six packs I'm in Nibi, but you know I was very sporty hey, so you're still one pack <laughs> oh one pack but I was sporty yeah, oh, okay, see yeah. I did you see I did you see I prosper it's not true okay. that during the vagina stretches Indefinitely is not true. Okay. Abba. It doesn't. It doesn't. Thankfully. <laughs> yeah. If it did, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> that I think would be that strange. God created the vagina for that particular purpose mm. as well. Mm. Um, to be able to accommodate a baby coming out, mm. but also to be able to go back to its near normal size to perform the function that it was performing before the baby. The word is near normal. Yes, near normal. Almost as near to normal as Basically, no. Or Pacha said, and your dear, or you're a virgin, you to forget it. It's a virgin, don't you virgin? No. On your virgin, no, do the labor hold her. Exactly. Yeah, you feel her. Yes, so don't, don't expect it to be Thank like you. that. Yes. A whole human being has come out. Yes, yes. But, so, but I don't think that mm -hmm. there is some change, but ultimately, mm. I think that it, because you see, some men are very apprehensive of that, you know, the fact yes. that no I, wife on you the same again. And I know a man because of that, he insisted that the wife has caesareans for but both you beds. Know, to compare caesarean to vaginal no, delivery. Seriously, he did. Hey. I think that this man may have had some misconceptions because mm. I don't think that it would be that noticeable if one, nothing traumatic happens during the delivery. Mm. Okay, so traumatic mean meaning that. Maybe the baby is too big or the delivery was too quick and the mother had some tears yes. and all other kinds of complications. Then that may cause some slowness in the return to normal. But usually because the vagina is, a, is an elastic, predominantly elastic tissue, it stretches and comes back to near normal. Mm. But especially when after delivery you put in the effort to exercise mm. and tone those muscles, muscles and yeah. strengthen what they call the pelvic floor. So all those exercises called the Kegels exercises help to return. I have a question. That's when you finish, you finish. That help to return. Whole anatomy to near no. normal to the point that you should still be able to enjoy yourself. Yes. yes. Okay. Ma, let me ask a quick one. Mm -hmm. So please, Sister Ava, can you please famous your patient? Explain Kegels exercises to her. So it basically means that or the etchim kaka. Etchim then. No, etchim kaka. Oko. So typically you do it when you 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 go to the loo. Yes. Uh -huh. Good. And that's a nice opportunity to hold because when the wee wee is coming, you, you should try and hold the wee wee from coming for a couple of seconds, and then release. That will cause the muscles of the pelvic the floor, floor, you know, to contract and contract and then tighten up. So that you are less likely so to have this. Once you're able to know how to hold the urine, that's a good starting point. Even as you're sitting here now, if you've learned how to hold the urine, you can be holding the urine inside of you, just like that. And it strengthens the pelvic floor and it really helps. You see, she said that the uh, um, vagina is designed for that. If you take, if you look at the vagina, it's sewn in some folds. Mm -hmm. So even before delivery, God has made <laughs> ready to expand. Mm. So once it's, it's 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 not like it's stretching and has to come back. It's just sort of opening up, mm. of course, with some stretching, mm. you know, and then sort of just closes in again on itself. So yes, there will be some changes, but the vagina will return to a fairly normal state. Mm. And then you know, if you're doing a good job, the shaft also with use. Use hypertrophy. Hey, <laughs> goodness! <laughs> you see, this is a I small mean, inside that. joke. I have a book now. So, I use on the exercise. I was in the. I don't know exercise. Shaft hypertrophy. I don't know. I don't know I don't know exercise. Exercise, man. Disclaimer. So I have no idea what you're talking there, about. Tell, 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 <laughs> Mr. there, hopefully, tell you, tell you, if you have been doing the work well over the years since the time you met your partner, and you've been using the machine. Mm. They want to hopefully don't be afraid that your wife's own will get bigger. Get than bigger. Yours. 
Yosu, pray that you also, you you know, <laughs> you wish to, <laughs> <laughs> and then. Uh, Let me know before soap or how. <laughs> oh, oh, but uh, there is some, there is some, Recession, some, eh? some evidence to show that the more you use the organ, the more it gets bigger. I could mm. ask some personal questions, but I'd rather not. <laughs> But generally, I think that women answer. who use all sorts of concoctions because they are afraid they'll lose their men after childbirth, just in the aim of tightening or getting it back to what they think normal is, and sometimes even abnormal, in my, I think, would be, um, should be careful about yes. it. If truly something really traumatic did happen, I'm sure that your doctor or midwife would inform you. And I'm, I've heard that now there are medical procedures um, by very very specialized people for such cases like it's very rare i've spoken to one doctor like that before and um, i don't know if he doesn't mind mentioning his name but maybe not but that's something that's part of his work that he does um, from time to time but he says it's very 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 rare for that to happen but a few women can have a, such a tear that they need a repair and yes. in, in that repair doesn't yes. mean that you know um so they, are, they are making them become like virgins but mm -hmm. it can happen. Oh, it gets Such a tear can happen. You know, yeah. when when the tear happens, mm. if it's not sewn well, yeah. sometimes there's a dysmorphism. The mm -hmm. perineal area doesn't look right. Mm -hmm. You know, aside the feel, it doesn't look right. Mm -hmm. So sometimes you may have to undo it, do literally it open it and exactly. then redo I'm it. I'm sure that's what he was and trying to explain about And about Eina Nekan, the woman who tried to tighten up, not just delivery, mm -hmm. after delivery. Some of them, even before mm -hmm. they deliver, they have all these things to sort of tighten the area. Are, are they are they doing open shut no, no, no. them? No, no, no. They, they <laughs> like the, all the time. The idea for for what I've heard is that it sort of makes them tight and gives a perception to the man partner or the man that they haven't been exposed. Oh, and okay. it actually has very bizarre complications mm, mm. when such um, but it because some of them do this by fibrosis yes, so the form of yeah. scar tissues, tissues yes. so if you have you're in the whole habit of doing that now but you actually for instance if you get pregnant and you can't relax and open like the vagina is supposed no, you, to do you can't give birth through that then you tear through yes. it. exactly just and a fibrous tissue cannot, cannot expand yeah. and relax also, it yeah. just tears yeah. like a scar mm. yeah so that oh, is I, I don't want to imagine that so um, we'll meet a little boy or girl or a family. You see, I can't even describe it because that's what it is. It's something that it's not very common to see and the family, they don't even know how to talk about it, let alone me. First <laughs> I'm so afraid of you. I'm so afraid of you. so afraid of you. I'm so so afraid of you. I'm so afraid of you. I'm so afraid of you. I'm so afraid of you. i i Naturally, it's 
Naturally, ne a eh, born or the bear for Johnson a toilet. Toilet and so back. Until one other or rash was a son no call back. Or quite another third operation. Most of by a son chin person to a separate bill. No one's on so good in infinite bill. Until at the moment, no one why no two no a born. Why a born a bad toilet in film. Until yes, also call back for an infinite. Until no shatter or dead day be be added to. Bibi had better name for most of my uncle toilet. I bet check a hand a map, a night on every day, and all best. And welcome to him, Mrs. Senator at Sanaba. Now could put one now, my Dutch. In the seconds, be I awkward or the DBI or there check him up. Instead of the local toilet on it to me, yes, sure, Nemphy. Nay, you like me for lay out your full fries, the man and lay. You're quite another fourth operation. None, what pen, eh? Because on the third one, why you need to know, but don't want to see in square. Why you know why you need to be a crap, you look up. What to seek a summer show? The people be some day. I better for stay a coffee dry until you phone no air for no way a problem so no. Jaden, what uncle school? No uncle school, I better now. I better know I see. First, Nanka so babies and one day. Jade me and one because I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to talk to you. And I need to answer to no question. I'm a fan of you. And I see you. I'm a fan of 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 you. Sisi <laughs> I, the idea of Jaden's full recovery would mean multiple surgeries, right? First and because foremost, for no me. genitalia, where even where the urinary tract, there's no, I, I can't see anything for urinary tract. We didn't hear anything about fecal matter. So, you know, all that has to be reconstructed or what? So, so there is a urinary. Trapped. Yeah, it's there is a, um, a place of fecal matter, but they haven't Outlet. formed well. Okay. On there, in the growing embryo, they all form from a common bud, mm. common either whole, mm -hmm. but it's supposed to have um, a septum either mm -hmm. or the only tube mm -hmm. or the tube no, or the tube close, no soup, not a new queen, no tube, a tube. So um, the, good. It's, okay. it's a tube that connects in the beginning. No, we you know our separate je, um, stomachs. Then, yeah. It's ban side and from side okay. you know. But when this closing one happen well, uh, then you see that it's all now one and together. Mm. Now this has bizarre mm. complications because on the extra sub toilets in it, not say Sala Sanchin it's uh Sanchin is um, um organisms know what toilet side and if they are not partitioned or separated from the urine side, they're gonna go up. Mm. It's gonna have constant mm. infections, infections yeah. here and there. I mean, before we even go to the psychology of how the family is taking it, I think that uh, having an understanding of how these things happen reduces the 
propensity that you be name in Kofuas, Bosomba, and yeah. things like that. <laughs> ah, but like I asked, will it require multiple surgeries? It probably will. Mm. And it will require a staged, well planned procedure. Okay. Because it depends also on the extent of the um, of the anomaly, okay. which um, organ systems are involved, at what level mm. are they involved, mm. um, are other organs involved. It will require a multidisciplinary team mm. approach um, to do this in a systematic, staged mm. uh, manner. Yeah. I'm thinking also the social bit of it, where so you have a baby, oh, it's a boy, it's a girl. Mm. At birth, they present your baby to you you are not sure whether it's a boy or it's a girl. So what would be the recommendation? Is it that I'm just throwing this for us to discuss. What, what would be better to say that as a parent, I think my child is a girl and that's how I'm going to bring Please. the child up. I think that it is very tricky because you might say this baby looks like a girl, but then we'll find out later on it's that boy. it's actually a boy. Um, genetically, mm. and then now reconditioning the child's mind, mm. the parent's mind, the nosy relative's mind, mind yes. about what this child really is. I forgot about the community. The mm. community, exactly. Everybody involved who will be now wondering why this person looks like a girl, dresses like a girl, but... It's a boy. Yes. I mean, so, um, so to say that, I mean, we, it's a difficult place for any parent mm. to be. But um, the mother can say, a start off a cadeau or a binion, mm -hmm. then at puberty, Uba yeah, Fred that's where it really shows. It's now it? developing yeah. breast, it becomes yeah. a little difficult yeah. to do. Mm -hmm. So, there are testings, mm -hmm. there are ways to test mm -hmm. and determine genetic, you know, to test early to on, early, early yeah. so much, that you know which way to, you know, lean towards mm -hmm. so that you get a um, better look. Child's yes, chances yeah, of yeah. living a fairly normal. Yeah, well, I'm, once again, I'm grateful to Vodafone Healthline because I'm sure that with their help, um, Jaden's parents, or actually mother and grandmother, would be able to find out what gender he really is and get the surgeries he needs, or he or she needs, from what Abba is saying now. I'm not even sure how to address it. It's confusing. And we do not want to label, we do not want to accuse, and it's not right. We just we just pray for baby Jaden because we're sure that he'll be just fine. We'll be right back. Also, bet me your quenyas from co. I hear Nija year power of Vodafone so. Yeah, the data bundles are any says so or Ghana hub brill. Yeah, more dia so. Yeah, need us one in Nabim. Ain't it back? I am home. Yeah, data money. Yeah, power be brie. Vodafone further together. So, the question is if there's fat in the liver, and so what? After all, there's fat in our bodies. It's here, crown says, Radia, she's a connoisse, on a patch. It is Radia, we believe on one umbrella, one eye. Then, sir, I said, Oh, I'm not saying to understand this. We have Dr. Amwakudria from UGMC, that's University of Ghana Medical Center, to explain this to us because I have a feeling it can be deadly. Doc, welcome to Vodafone Healthline. Thank you, <laughs> Doc. One more moment. Yeah, very well, who as in, as in the liver, the functions, uh, why is it important? And whether actually having fat in it is dangerous or not. If you can briefly tell us about that. And she said, you can't be able to live in the liver. The idea is that you can't be able to live in the liver. 
ye die no etimi e digest no okay and uh, the yeah body ni here no at that particular time no body no na a store okay so the be ya say we ni pedua ni here na say we nya ni di ya liver no e de be ba emoje no so the be ya body no betimi aye aduma so the e city e and i say we did ya once say say did ya aduane aye di ni nyina say e koye yam na say ya digest ya na se moja no twetwe enuanu nuru nu aye hia na ni nyina esa kofa liver no bio ansa na aba your body no enti eboa ema e yi enyoma fi a aduane no aye di ni kura ewo mu no liver no boa ema no e yi film ana liver no so e produce ni ama bebre ema your body no aye aduma yi o hwe proteins ye wo ye ni pedua mu bebre a aye liver no ne produce eh proteins no ebi ni clotting factors on se eni pa wo ho na se bi bi twa wa eh edru ba bi abun se umia ho na asili yes aha e kroto na asili ba bi a wo twa ye no sa eni ma ni nyina ye liba e na e produce o enti se liba na am produce a ana so wo liba ya de na se ntimi produce sa clotting factors na bi bi twa wo se ya wo bi di sa sa na tie ana de the last important uh, young person make a new vano boa emma a ye a dear me fin baby a free ye new pedrianum. Okay. Once we be a house when you are John Dis, when you are live by a dear when you are John Dis. John Dis, you know, a year and your ma, I was a timid flu with new pedrianum, a year live by no producer, not a year flim. Aha, and he said, We live by no year you may ya, going to that at that one is so because live by no. Into me a new flea with the pedianum. And I yes, also, I have a man my yellow. I yes, also, we do your dianya slide, dear woman, because I dare not a yellow no, but now I'll call young snowman and a babble and I'll change our dear no. A flea dianya yadim. Okay, and it's a bar no into me, no one soon no more. Or more motel this idea, Diana, no books or more cotterati as I dare and go on ever. Because in the pediano, into me. And change, Mujanimin. I know that men can say, "Yeah, once you have with cholesterol, uh -huh. it's the liver that produces that cholesterol." Okay. Okay. So we will eat fat, mm. and the fat will get into the liver, uh -huh. and the liver will turn it In, into things we into need. Into things that we need. Okay. Uh -huh. But a bedroom baby, no bones, the liver no changing into cholesterol. Now, uh -huh. I said to me, "Free liver, no, no, but you need pedrianum." And I am Mojanum, no Mojana de Cop, a new Pedriano baby in here. One more and more excess amount of fat in the liver. Mm -hmm. Aye, one more fat in you know, liver no produce, but in Timin Fleet, the bonum. Oh, and I say, but you know, a ma liver no pressure or the Sladio Bibli, a ma liver, and uh -huh. to liver no a change, you know, when Timin Fanning in a ma the Mojanum, na a gina, the bonum. Say a genomusa no a dangerous a ma dangerous. Then a deba, then a bema Stradia Nako Tile Vanimusa. Ya one near my bear and naya a man a deba. And tis a cassa, Sadia Bibri or Mojan will live a numa. A chess say the amount of fat in the liver is more than five per cent of the liver weight. Okay. The weight of the liver. Okay. A dear, a decay a man the pap, a de bapaya, alcohol. Aye, one more more no more in some bibliano, you move bend ninety per cent, or more fatty liver. And your friend, alcoholic fatty liver disease. They're tossing you new year, say, say one said, Eh, you were a dear be a friend of metabolic syndrome. That metabolic syndrome, one more more diabetes, one more more esso bibliano, yeah, you overweight and now obesity. And now one more cholesterol be bre wo mo mojanum. Mm -hmm. Yes, one more dyslipidemia and now high cholesterol. And one more more hypertension. Mm -hmm. So ha, and your man nine, nine. way mm -hmm. and a day non your friend non alcoholic fatty liver disease because I know your alcohol and a deba. 
And this annual my way, and I know so did non alcoholic fatty liver disease never. And yes, our yard, you will honor my and no affected liver and that. Okay. Oh, BT say hepatitis B, hepatitis C. Oh, and I autoimmune hepatitis, yard, dear who do be a affected liver and that. And no sit to me, master, I dear be bread and agina. And I feel the acano to be all pursued loose weight within a short time. Mm, I'm not how I seek it to diet. Ah. No, lose within a short time. I know to me, my fat is not. I have a fair friend, son, and none of the bread born. Not slightly uncoa and the genome. And this anima, your castle fatty liver, sanima, and nine way, and a man or a deba. Doc, what can non alcoholic? My dear cohopa, if I try, I mean, how uncle hocka cra. Eh, says a non alcoholic, no, 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 once I first know uh, hepatitis B and hepatitis C, mm. and only your castle chronic liver disease, and only your dear tau body. Any B, Nanny, a coji, a vassin, no, vassin, uh -huh. no, non alcoholic, no. Once that diabetes, you do so, it will be as a true. And then you probably so yakase. Hey, so, ah, ah, and I, a dear, you know, I said fast food, fast food, and I sugar, and you cook. And ne a ye a ye pie, your word, you mamma. So drinks no dross. That's a pressure, and tea into me, and cold breaking could did the papa. Nanny, a near Tony, and no me, and some one at a facon, near the facon. Eh, yan yes, a size. Cause they say, the new papa bring yes come the attacker. Eh, and to a cohane hakura, no a tuka. Or bear you mamma, they be a three stroller burden, four stroller burden. Uncle, lift to a ho, and I'm there be over five lift. Oh, and tea. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exercise. Um, yeah, yeah, inactive. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And because of a near my way, and I'm a non alcoholic fatty liver. No, I do soon be brave. I walk. If you are say, I always say, sure. yeah, Ghana, Ghana, come uh -huh. And to be what non alcoholic fatty liver na Signs ben and a symptoms ben no benya no who say be a oh, where they say, may Jane say, may I know, may Mincona Minko who liver specialist, and I will be some known shaman. And say, we are saying, we are dear, a book, no amounts in San Sobia. Yeah, and then you have found a silent killer. So now, I can't say, no, come at two. You are a book, no, you are a hello, Debbie Debbie. I'm out in your yama, I want to do, no, 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 Eh, so na ya dear no, na a shame on it, dinas, and to fatty liver, and you say, and you say, a new probably a moon who she. But the time I am who will be a fatty liver, and I say, on send you part, Nansen, no so, a new penny, a bow or more a pump, you know, no cray, and tea, and my own hospital, say yearly check up, and every six months, if you are more your check up. So I'm your check up on a new visit, there be or more liver function, no problem or ya be hwehwe mu no na na ye fat ene de aba eni pa ka kra bi ne beba o meka se o o mo right side of the abdomen no they have pain there okay mm. or maybe the liver because of the excess amount of fat in the liver the liver has become bigger than it's supposed to be mm. so when you touch it on the right side the upper part you can feel that the liver is there mm. okay so sometimes pain the liver enlarges and some of them today have fatigue. Oh, yeah, you make a crabby, you are bread. I don't know, yeah, and since I saw a bachelor and say, Be a who are fatty liver. Most of the time, no, who mm. she either so on Beba, no, not fat, no, I will hold no more. Not a cerebral born, no, no, Drew Baby, as a friend of cirrhosis. Okay, Drew cirrhosis, who are just a whole liver filler, no, I don't know. Said the acquire as a bread born this year, you man. Brabono intimate yet a juma. But Brabo, I want pe into your cirrhosis now, not a liver failure now. Then I'm away. Oh, more treatment be a muddy man called for Yana. There must one more lucky now. I can't hello. I, I, eh, Seba non alcoholic fatty liver now. Once I know no, you name the man a deba. Ain't he so will be Nassio Huno, the man a deba. Sebia, whom why you do be bray, and I will be city. I can't was a moon. Or so tia. So, tibet by 7.5 or 10% of your baseline weight. Why are you tight? Why are you Why are you tight? It's me, boy. I'm a blow bono. And that's a big jina baby, a jina and condemning. My man, find your mask, Akra. Just so be what it be, I will be weight, say. 
Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yeah. Day be I be out to me to see bear one kg. Every day, every week, be I would lose you one kg. One kg, I every week, aye, aye, mom. I said, you bear so no betting, cacra, cacra. I also ten ten to my no so ever send fatty liver. Fatty liver. Yaka said, my son, ten chess, a queen, giddy giddy. Sanity, and a dog, I did back home, send which I'm my dream. One more more. Oh, 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 Heart attack and a stroke oh. and a heart failure. Oh. Uh, no, no, because on such a come metabolic syndrome, no, a tad non alcoholic fatty liver disease, you banner. And no, also no cause of heart attack, and no one no cause of stroke, and no one no cause of a a ye, as a very peripheral vascular disease. On so blood vessels, you know, after now, no, 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 I just say risk factors, you know, for cardiovascular disease. Oh, so what that? You have it. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So they die more of the cardiovascular disease mm -hmm. than even the, the liver disease. Right. And smoking is a major risk factor when it comes to cardiovascular disease. Na age? Once I say, you know, now I'm going to say, once I say, you know, especially in my life, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I'm Diabetes never, na hypertension never. It's one more more in you know, more fat than one more woman in the young. And the age is so a year like a risk factor for mm. obia, obeying me a developer of fatty liver. No more can you know, mammy Phyllis say, a qualine to me, not fatty liver. However, no, my same trends are. First, I can say diabetes type 2 crown can call in your genes when you do baby. Now, saying you know, we have a cardiovascular disease that started 20 years, 19, be crap 15 years. No more crack as any man. Is it possible for them to get fat in the body? If you see, once you are obese, and now you see most of the children when you see them, they are overweight or obese, mm. and then that's where the fatty liver starts. Mm. Okay, and when you develop it early, then it means that the chances of it progressing mm. is high. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. so we don't want our children to eat unhealthy food mm. so that they become obese, they develop fatty liver at early age group. Then, if like they keep on growing, then the fat in the liver will destroy the 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 yeah. liver cells. Yeah. And the liver will not be able to yeah. to function That's well. True. Yeah. That's so true. it affects everybody, whether you are a child, you are mm -hmm. adult. Yeah. And to take home message for us here then. And to take home message, you say, uh, say, say fatty liver and adults in Ghana. And when you probably or more quite scan for maybe other investigation, and you say, or more liver and fatty baby. Uh -huh. The American say, the other banner, you know, alcohol. And now, or more more diabetes, or more more soon baby, or more more new exercise. In your near and your healthy, I did you know. These are the things that brings about fatty liver. And when you have fatty liver, it can progress to destroy the liver, mm. and you will develop liver failure, and sometimes liver cancer. Mm. Okay, and you know liver cancer is the commonest cause of cancer death in this country. Okay, and once we have fatty liver, and it can lead to liver cancer. Then we all have to make sure that the risk factors in the banu. You be hunu na so what diabetes? You are managing diabetes in the So we move do it. I'm making sure so by exercise we be did the year now we sweat the year. So our cholesterol be blue. We move jamwa. 
ya do betu adro so na the lifestyle intervention na ka ho said the be ya cholesterol and be ba fam when we do all these things even if you have the fatty liver it will not progress okay to destroy the liver to a point in time that the liver will not be able to support you to live okay and if the liver is unable to support you to live then it means that you will take a lead and join our ancestors then <laughs> we will follow you later. hey mr yes. so anya stress mm -hmm. doctor das amaya ti ase eh ye na dey watch enyo ma o nkola kra nya kef nkra nya kef and say so mokra so so champion oh yes oh yes 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 am papa we have learned so much now we know stradia be brave and yet period <laughs> period we'll be right back Who's who bet me in your quenyas from co? I yeah, need a year power Vodafone so. Yeah, the data bundles are any says so or gonna have braille. Yeah, more dia so. Yeah, need a swan in nabim. Ain't it back? I am home. Yeah, data money. Yeah, power be brave. Vodafone further together. Jaden is a patient of ours who's been with us for a number of years. Um, he was born with a bit of a complex um, abnormality and made up basically of, let me say, three parts. One is the fact that there was no normal anal opening, um, so stool was not coming out normally. The other one was that there was no normal urinary open, and there was no real normal phallus. And therefore, when the child was born, there was confusion about the sex of the child. And, um, and the parents were not sure what, whether a child was a boy or, or, or a boy or a girl. So a number of investigations were done and a number of surgeries started. So the initial surgery that was done was to create an opening through which the child could pass to, through the abdominal wall. And this was done to allow the child to be able to feed and to grow a bit while we did our further investigations. They also have the challenge of a bladder that collects urine but again, without any control, and we need to think of surgery to bring control of urine. Then we have the third factor of the phallus or the penis. Now what's happening is that this child is passing urine from an opening, which is not through the penis. And even though we have formed one artificial one for him, he's going to need surgery in order to bring the urine to the tip of this phallus. However, it is known that when the child grows older, he's going to need a definitive surgery to form a phallus that he can use more in adult life. So even though he formed a phallus, the child is going to need another surgery, at least from the age of puberty going, to form um, an adequate phallus, and then also to bring the urine to the tip of it so that he can urinate like everybody else. So those are the plans we have for the future. In the meantime, he has a phallus and he's, he's, he's leaking the wind from the bottom of the perineum and has, does not have much control of that. With the timely assistance of Vodafone Healthline, we have secured funds for baby Jaden's surgery and we wish him all the best. Hello, once again. Today, in This Week in Medicine, we talk about the first successful penile and scrotum transplants. 
not just the penis, the penis and the scrotum. Before I tell you about that, I'll give you a historical overview of transplant surgery, where we came from and where we are. In the 16th century, Italian surgeon Gaspero Tagliacozzi, sometimes referred to as the father of plastic surgery, reconstructed noses and ears using skin from the forearms of patients. In 1905, Edward Zerm, an Australian ophthalmologist, performed the world's first corneal transplant. 1912 saw Alexis Carrel receive a Nobel Prize for his work in developing methods for connecting blood vessels and conducting the first kidney transplant in dogs. He went on, together with his friend Charles Lindbergh, to invent a device for keeping organs viable outside the body. In 1954, a team of doctors in Boston, the Peter Bent Brigham Hospital, performed the first successful human kidney transplant between twin brothers. Since then, several advances in transplant surgery has allowed several organs to be transplanted, with more advances in the transplant field ongoing. The first successful penis and scrotum transplant was performed in 2018 by a group of surgeons at the John Hopkins Hospital. The patient was a veteran that suffered a blast injury at war in Afghanistan. It took 14 hours to complete. Um, I hear someone asking me a question. What about the testes? Were they transplanted? No, they weren't. This is all we have for this week in medicine. And the penny can offer can offer um, surgery. What you offer? Ebia nimpa nanka sa no honam fi one side. What about another side? An awful bin honam and na no body part. What if fi nimpa kro no dem another person? How often transplant surgery? Chede transplanting was starti ache. Doctor says soon wa kum wa ye wa cha but nan sing na mina dum. The field of transplant surgery why ye more convenient. Many more people will need a kidney transplant, lung transplant, heart transplant, and then yamiasi. That's all we have for this week in medicine. Welcome in today's episode of Duos in the Kitchen with me, Perma. We'll be talking about. Esurisa. Yes, we said a form we said the other time. This Esurisa basically is the black one. We said it in two Okay, this is from Ghana black pepper. Actually, it's very similar in function to Kokono because it also helps your cough. Interestingly, it's anti <laughs> antioxidant, it's antimicrobial, and it helps the body become strong. It's actually also used like a food preservative just like pentia okay so we want to do that but it's got no aphrodisiac properties whatsoever none okay so don't confuse the two it's the red that has the aphrodisiac properties this doesn't this is just basically antioxidant it is antimicrobial it helps with gut to boost your immune system and it's good with cough so that's basically what the dark one does but we got it the canyon pepper it, it does i've tried it with the cough thing though um, mm. it was it was it gave me some sort of relief mm. and I, was, mm. I was really impressed mm. the, 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 the i see now, yeah, now, the now we brew in like tea because i didn't want to, i didn't have a, something to blend it up so i brewed it like tea and i sipped it so i think the warmth you, you guys understand that the thing about cough more than i do i wonder the warmth and its own Antioxidant properties and whatever it does with cough really did give me a good night's sleep. But I would not recommend it for a child because it's hot. Ah, ah, it is hot. So I was like, oh man, I wish it wasn't that hot. My babies can enjoy in the habitat. <laughs> it, it was it was a bit too hot. It, it won't be good for children. It won't be good mm -hmm. for children. So highlights for me was fatty liver disease. Um, apart from obviously you was in the kitchen, uh, fatty fatty liver and learning that non-alcoholic fatty liver disease is linked mm. to nutrition was like. Great news because when you keep telling people they don't believe you, but when the doctors themselves say it, they realize there's no propaganda that nutritionists have been saying or that teachers have been pushing us to eat well, eat well, eat well. You know, it's, it can affect us in a very, very negative way. So I was I was happy about that. Mm. Mm. I'm just going to 
encourage us to remember to do the Kegels exercises mm. as often as we can. Mm -hmm. You know, if you don't want um, some change that is worrying to that area, especially after delivery, mm. especially multiple delivery. So hold the urine when you're urinating, hold it for a couple of seconds, release. Hold a couple of seconds, release. And that should help to strengthen the pelvic okay. floor. Okay. Yeah. For me, I think I still want to talk about stigmatization. Mm. Um, from this week in medicine, we see how a young man can be stigmatized, you know, once again, through no fault of his, mm. you know, for several years. Um, we see how this, I mean, in other episodes, you know, it just keeps coming. And it's occurs to me how cruel we can be as people, you know, so let's Let's be more compassionate towards one another. Sure. And for Jaden, I really do pray that the end is glorious. We pray the same. If you have any more questions or you didn't understand anything at all, you can always call 255. We are qualified medical practitioners, doctors, and all of them are there to answer your questions. It's been a pleasure. I hope you now understand the form Risa and the true Risa. <laughs> and you will not mistake the two. Okay? But because so we of meet. Aphrodisia. Yes, yes, of course. <laughs> <laughs> the red means aphrodisiac all the way. The black means cough all the way. That's simple, you know. Nothing strange there. Anaba. And no, no, no. How much should I take if I want to use an aphrodisiac? It's regular use. Regular. Ah, you said it. I'd already person. said that. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. <laughs> I'm just asking for a friend. <laughs> you had it drop. Yes. Okay, no challenge. <laughs> Once again, it's been lovely. We've learned a lot. We've actually had fun. Okay, we've had fun. And we know that learning doesn't stop here. Don't forget 255 is available to you all the time. Till we meet again next week, it's bye for now. Bye. Enjoy bye. your week. Vodafone, further together.